Well folks, Calvin here from Spare Night Doors and today we're going to do a wee, bit of, a wee bit of cast iron cooking with the Dutch oven over the fire and there's our ingredients and we're going to cook a beef pot roast So what we need for the pot roast is obviously your beef which is a 500 grams beef joint that I have here or something along them lines you want some beef stock four medium sized potatoes Either two large carrots or three small carrots, as I have here. Two onions. Olive oil. A beer of your choice, which you, whatever beer you like. And every any time you use a different beer, you have different flavour. And I'm just using Guinness, which is a stout. Sea salt, or any salt, and black pepper. And the instruments that you'll need will be obviously a knife for chopping, a spark, a big stirring spoon, measuring jug, obviously your Dutch oven, another plate and obviously your fire pit and tripod so what I'll actually do now I'll chop up all these veg into nice chunky sized pieces I'll put the Dutch oven on to get it heated up and I'll put a bit of oil in it to get it ready so we'll start chopping the veg <music> The, the pot roast beef and the, the Dutch oven over the open fire and as you can see my plates, my plates cleared and uh, was really tasty and I've actually fed the family there before we go out now we Easter egg hunt because it's Easter Sunday here today but it's a very simple one pot meal at about three hours does the whole thing it's a couple hours on the open fire with your veg and your, your beef cooking and it's about half an hour prep chopping your 
onions and getting everything ready so between two and three hours you have a good meal there real made and again you can change the variations of it it doesn't have to be beef you can use lamb if you want again you don't have to use carrots you can use parsnips again you can change the beer to have different flavors so you can have all these different variants to make a one uh, a pot roast of your choosing and I do tweak it around and change it and just change it the whole time you get different flavours and I quite like it with the stout with the Guinness it's quite nice but it tastes lovely with all our different beers as well and uh, I hope you go and have a go at trying the pot roast yourself to, to really taste it and smell it and it's, it's lovely and I hope you enjoyed this upload and I really I thank you for watching but if one more thing to say people keep asking me why they, where did I get my timber from um, well I'm a joiner and we old jobs that we're at we're taking out old timber and that rather than it going to the skip if we can reuse it we reuse it if it's rubbish and going to the skip we usually keep it and reuse it for burning on the fires and stoves and stuff so i've got loads of it and that's why i use that type of timber because i've got plenty of it so thanks for watching guys and i hope you enjoyed this pot roast